show, I'm Tom, and these are my friends, Glenn and Phil, and uh, <laughs> great friends. You know, last week was our first show, and we were all really nervous, so before the show, I was hanging out with Glenn and Phil mm -hmm. backstage, and uh, Glenn asked Phil to do something crazy. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> You know, to lighten the mood a little. Oh, Glenn, no. Oh, no. Glenn, no. why don't you tell everyone out there what you uh, uh, asked Phil to do? I, um, I asked, uh, <laughs> oh, oh, I asked him to uh, show his balls. <laughs> oh, oh Because he thought that Phil, you know, by oh, Phil showing us his, joke. because you thought by Phil showing us his balls, that that would make us laugh and it would help us relax. But it did, though. Yeah. <laughs> so looking at balls is relaxing to you, Glenn? No. No, <laughs> uh, no. no. Oh, that's, that's a moment. Oh, did you have a good weekend, Glenn? Laugh. Oh, yeah, I just kicked back, relaxed, looked at some balls. <laughs> what the hell are you doing to me? I like looking at balls. It's just uh, filled balls. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't even think we can say balls on MTV. Really? I don't think so. But we have uh, brought uh, Julie, the MTV Network's standards executive, here. Come on up here. And uh, you're the person who decides what is appropriate to say, what's inappropriate to say on air, right, Julie? Exactly. Right. We just said balls a whole bunch of times. <laughs> Can I say balls? Actually, you can say balls. Can I say, <laughs> Glenn likes to look at Phil's balls. <laughs> <laughs> Phil, Phil showed me his bang bangs. <laughs> it's fine. His bang no bangs. problem. Sent his little helpers. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we're talking about Phil <laughs> here. <laughs> with the standards person That's from That's something MTV. that you can't say. Oh, you can't say <laughs> Oh. <laughs> 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 So bad. Can you say like uh, skin chandeliers? <laughs> or uh, let's say uh, uh, the men who guard the ass sport. <laughs> yes, that's fine. That's that too far. Okay. You can't say that. You can. Have you met the men who guard the ass sport? <laughs> yes, I have. You have. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> What's that mean? Okay. <laughs> Thanks for helping us out, Julie. You're welcome. <laughs> Why don't uh, you stick around, Julie, and see why I'm not allowed in the National Art Gallery anymore? And th those guys have really strict rules at the National Art Gallery. Check this out. Hi, this is my painting that I made. It's called Tiger Zebra. I worked really, really hard on it. Now I'm going to go put it up in the National Art Gallery. Unless you want to call him, you can go to the desk and ask him to meet you here. Okay. But unless you have a pass, you're not allowed to go up the fence. We tried to get in that way, but uh, now there's a security guard chasing us. I just want to put the art on the wall. The insanity here is, is that we got away from the security guards, and Tiger Zebra is on the wall of the National Art Gallery. Now that I don't like. You don't like that? No. Yeah. You like landscapes? Yeah. You like, you like trees? Yeah. Well, let's put a tree on it. Let's put a little tree on it. Yes. Maybe some mushrooms or, or some little bit of rock for the question. Mushrooms? Do you do drugs or? I do not. No. Like magic mushrooms? Like but no, no mushrooms. Check out. Check this out. Come, oh, yeah. Check out. Come, check out. 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 Oh, yeah? Okay. You turn it off like that? What do you do? What do you do? Which button is it? Yeah. Come on. I don't know how to turn it off. Oh, well, no, it's the red button. Uh, I got it. It's this button here. Right. Yeah. What's here? Just take it. Okay, I'll take it. I'll turn it okay. off. No, no, that's the left-right switch. That's not the off switch. Okay. No, get it off. Get it off. Okay, you But I don't think we should take I that off. Turn it off right now. Okay. And then stick around here, please. Go ahead. Go. And then we'll be right back. And then stick around here, please. Okay. We'll put it by the security desk. Okay, so we're running. We're running. What do we run? It's not normally the way we get out of these situations. But right now we are. We're running.
back, I'd, I'd like to introduce Derek Harvey. Ladies and gentlemen, Derek Harvey, come on out here. Have a seat there. Thanks. <laughs> says here that you're a writer on the show. Is that true, Derek? Yeah, that's true, Tom. Ah, that's neat. Uh, do I know anything that you've written for the show, Derek? Yeah, you do, Tom. That thing we just watched right now, the art gallery thing. Mm -hmm. I wrote that one. Okay. Yeah, I was also the cameraman for that too. I don't know if you saw me in the background. <laughs> you did. Uh, you did a good job. I, uh, I also wrote this interview we're having right now, too. <laughs> right, right now. So that's how I know that the next thing you're going to say will be, wow, that is weird. Wow, that is weird. <laughs> so, yeah, that's, that's right. uh, it also says here that you're good friends with Glenn, Phil, and, and myself. Yeah. <laughs> Known you guys for years, right, Glenn? <laughs> friends for a long time. You're my best friend in the whole world, Tom. <laughs> Thanks. Um, <clears throat> you brought a clip with you. Do you want to set up the clip? Yeah, I'll set up this clip. Um, you're in this clip, I think. Actually. Great. Yeah, you're oh, going to be in this clip. Um, you're on a ship. Oh! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You're talking to a, a Chilean sailor. Okay. <laughs> that sounds really crazy. We're on a Chilean naval vessel here today in the port of San Diego. Well, my, my English is very bad. Oh, no, you're good. You're good at English. And that there is a banana, right? All right. That's a banana right there. Right. These are all monkey skeletons, right? All right. Yeah. So all those things there are monkey skeletons, right? Yes, right. A ventilator? Ventilator. Okay. And you use that for putting cream all over your body? Correct. So, so you, t you hook a hose up to that and then you Correct. shove it up your nose and clear all the mucus out of your nose? Yes. Yeah. I, you speak English much better than I speak Spanish. Yeah. Yeah. Um, my grandmother's head's on fire. Yes? Yeah. <laughs> And that's for if your grandmother has a submarine? Yes, correct. You blow up your grandmother's submarine with those? Correct. <laughs> so do the sailors on the boat, do they, do they masturbate a lot? Or <laughs> a lot of masturbating. Correct. So you must masturbate about 10 times a day, I guess? Uh, lit. A little bit. Uh, Portal. Those are wheels? Here, uh, Moye. Oh, okay, for having sex. Correct. <laughs> Muchas gracias. You're welcome. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Uh, we're back. Coming up, a lady who gives mouth to mouth to pets, a really big contest, and a whole lot more. So keep it here. Keep it right here. You know the name of him? No, I don't know. We don't know. I don't know. <laughs> we don't know. I don't know. You know, you know who I'm talking about? You know who I'm talking about, though? <laughs> no, 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 no. Stop, 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 stop. Guy, I have to find out who this stop. guy's name is. <laughs> Wait, what's that? I just see him. I just see him here, though. Okay, okay, okay. Go, go. Go, no, wait. <laughs> oh, no, I said, no, I said, excuse me. No, no, no. Hey, my, my name. Okay. See you later. <laughs> Bye. 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 having a good time. <laughs> having a great time, yeah. Glenn Hubbock's having a good time so far. Thanks for laughing. Seriously, you're great. Phil is, uh, uh, isn't it great having Phil here? Well. You know, I mean, uh, no matter what happens on the show, Phil always will laugh and support us because he's, he's, he's our friend. Because he's our friend and he supports yeah. us. Thanks, <laughs> If you ever wondered what happens to your coins after you toss them into a... Phil <laughs> 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 really likes to laugh. And, uh, <laughs> we're definitely, we must be killing tonight. <laughs> yeah, our jokes, we must be, we just must, hit, be. must be just hitting all the we're jokes good. tonight. Well. If you ever wondered what happens to your coins after you toss them into a fountain. You might want to take a look at this next bit. I 
am Scuba Hood. I steal from the poor and give to the rich. the camera on? Essentially, I work for the bank. But you never, ever, ever do this again. Okay? Okay. That is not cool. I steal from the poor and I give to the rich. Who are you? What's your name? Scuba Hood. No, what is your real name? Scuba Hood. And I give to the rich? No. I'm going to the bank now and I'm going to give them... Are you going to be more cooperative? No. What is his real name? Oh, okay. I'll give you my real name. Doug? Fisher. What's your address, Doug? Okay. I don't want to tell you one more time to turn that camera off, okay? All that's left to do now is to go drop this money off at the bank, where the rich get richer, poor get poorer. I'd like you to have this. I'd like you to have this. Put that in your copper. Okay. Here, how about this contest? Oh, stop. Oh, stop. We need two volunteers from the audience here, okay? And, uh, oh, you? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Come on, you guys. You guys. Okay, come on. Come on. I'm not, I'm not just the host of, uh, what are your names, by the way? C.A. C.A.? C.A. Pete. Pete. Nice to meet you. I'm, uh, I'm actually not just the host of this TV show here. I'm also an arts and crafts expert, okay? I uh, don't use watercolors or, or clay. What I use is human hair. Okay. okay. We've collected this human hair from local barber shops. What's your favorite animal? A dog. A dog. Okay. Some uh, petroleum jelly here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to make a little dog for you. There you go. Thank you. And what's your favorite animal, Pete? Cat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Make your little cat there. Okay, we're going to have a contest with our animals. <laughs> My favorite animal happens to be a Sasquatch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so here's the contest. Dog, cat, Sasquatch. Okay, on the count of three, the person who wins is the first person who can eat their animal, okay? <laughs> One, two, three, go! Like hugging? Oh, it's all right. It's all right. Did you get a lot of hugs? No, no, no. Sure. What was the last time you hugged? Well, I probably hugged a girl, hurt my sister, or something like that, but never hugged you know, a guy. I mean, you hug a lot of guys? No, no, no. no. It's pretty fun, though, eh? Well, it's all right. <laughs> you think it's sort of romantic, what we're doing? Well, it's, it's kind of, I don't know, it's kind of strange. A little bit, eh? Yeah. Do you love me? <laughs> well, I don't hate you. If you think I'm sexually attractive? Let's be honest, though. Am yeah. I sexually attractive? To you? <laughs> You're not bad. Okay. <laughs> Leslie Oliver. 
a veterinarian, right? Uh, no, no. I'm an EMS worker, one of those people from 911. <laughs> you know, when the ambulance starts screaming, you know, that's, wha that's who I am. Oh, but you, you teach people how to perform CPR on animals, though, right? Absolutely. Yeah. Infants, children, adults, and animals. But you're not a veterinarian, though. I am not. But, but you I have some animals here. Yes. And you, so just because, have you ever performed CPR on an animal before? Yes, I have. I've worked for veterinarians, and I've done it in surgery. And you've saved its life? Yes. What kind of animal? Cats, dogs and cats. Show me what you did to the dog. Okay, well, first we did some rescue breathing. <laughs> Put your hand right here. Stand right here. Okay, first we did some rescue breathing. <laughs> Feel that? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so uh, we did plate lungs. You did this to a dog. <laughs> did that to a dog. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Uh, do it, do it, do, do it. it. <laughs> okay, that's how you do it for a dog. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now it's time to do some CPR. First you need to feel a pulse. Okay. Put your hand right here. Okay. What do you feel? Uh, a pulse? Yeah, pulse. exactly. Okay, good. So wow. if you felt a pulse, we wouldn't do CPR. And you brought in this uh, dead baby, I see. Well, actually, With this, you? this is a facsimile of what a dead baby would look like. It's a, little, it's a little inappropriate to have a dead baby as a pet, though, isn't it? Oh, no, we don't want them as pets, but we do want to know how to rescue them in the event of an emergency. We really do want to know. Oh, okay. Well, yes. do do the CPR on this quick. On the, on the inside? <laughs> Forget about that. Okay. Let's see this, okay? Okay, sure. What you would do is you would do a head tilt chin lift. Okay. Tilting the head back, holding quick, quick, on. Quick, 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 Got a little lipstick on the baby. Yeah, he's a little bit. I should probably. Here, I'll just put this over here, okay? Oh, no. <laughs> he can't do that to the baby. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm just going to set it over there. No. You can't really catch. Where hey, are listen, you? Listen, 911, uh, emergency <laughs> people. That was a catch and a half. You better believe it. I probably it. should have mentioned this earlier. I have actually my, brought my pet on. Okay. And my pet is actually experiencing some shallow breathing as well. Okay. Oh, my so goodness. Let's maybe. see what we can do. You want to help us out here? Sure. Come help on. Him. It's Come on, over. Tell us. Get the sheet. <laughs> And pizza. Stick it back. Dominoes. Oh, sure. 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 We're never going to save her, are we? No, we won't. But you can say your goodbyes. You can say your terrible, goodbyes. Terrible, terrible news. I agree, but you can say your goodbyes. You did something. See, at least you tried to help. Suppose you could. Oh! <laughs> okay. Uh, this is. <laughs> Good you know, I, I actually uh, I tried to revive a moose once. Did you? Yeah. And you then what happened? Well, watch. Well, I'll show you, Leslie. <laughs> let's, let's go see me reviving a moose. <laughs> I was just driving along, and I was trying to open up a can of juice and adjust my radio at the same time. And then all of a sudden, this thing jumps out of the woods right in front of me. I'm like, ah! Maybe we can revive it. Come on, here. Oh, we got to go. I'll, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hump it like this, and you give it mouth to mouth, okay? Come on! Come on! You guys, we can help it! Guys, come back! We can help him! We can revive him! Come back! Come on, come on. Come on, boy. We want to revive it. Here, come hump it with me. It'll get its heart going again. Come on. Come on, come on we can revive it. We can. Come on, man. Thanks for watching. Thank you to Leslie Oliver. Thank I want you. to thank Julie Taylor, Glenn Humplick, Phil Giroux, and uh, Little Bo Peep here. Yeah. <laughs>